Hey there, Geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. A little bit premature, but we're going to show you how to block Windows 11 from installing. This may change. Also, there's third-party apps that aren't updated yet because Windows 11 isn't out yet. And those will probably help you do it a lot easier. My personal favorite is Group Policy Editor. If you don't have it, you can enable Group Policy Editor. Look for the links in the video description or for the little eye up here somewhere. And you can enable Group Policy Editor. For example, it doesn't come on Windows 10 Home. That's what I'm using here. But I have it. So let's open it up. Windows key plus R. gpedit.msc. That will open the Group Policy Editor. And we're going to work our way down to Local Computer Policy. Computer Configuration. Right here. Administrative Templates. Let's see what we got here. Windows Components. Windows Update. Move this over a hair. Windows Update. And finally, Windows Update for Business. All right. What we're looking for is right here select the target feature update version. Now, once again, this is kind of for advanced users, so depending on where we are with Windows 10, you need to know the last version of Windows 10 released, the largest feature update. Currently, it was 21H2, whether it'll be updated before Windows 11, I don't know. So let's double click it. And what you wanna do here is click on enabled, which makes this something you can type in now. And you can type in whatever the last feature update was, which is now gonna tell Windows 10 to stop there and not update the next feature update and again keep in mind this is currently all beta and we'll change it as needed once you're done with that click OK and you are all set all right next up I'm not gonna do too much of this I'm just gonna show you because again we're kind of in beta I need 11 to come out to verify all of this back up your registry you can download our registry files right here the nice thing about that is it will feature this registry file here so this one will block Windows 11 beta will change your registry to what I'm about to show you and this one will restore you so that no harm is done but backing up your registry is always a good idea I'm not going to go through this because again advanced users can follow along a couple problems I've had a few people said this steps above I showed you didn't show up in Windows 10 home when they added group policy editor so everybody's a little different but just to give you an idea of what you can do so we're going to want to open the registry editor I'll show you real quick Windows key plus R and do regedit, R-E-G-E-D-I-T, press enter or click OK. Right here, clear that out, control V, and we're Microsoft Windows, confirm you're in the right location. H key local machine, software policies, Microsoft Windows. Now you're gonna have to create a new key under Windows, which will be here. So you do right click, new key, and you would name that Windows Update one word. Now again, not the easiest one. Now you're gonna click on the Windows Update key you just created and you're gonna create two D words. Target release version, target release version info. Then you're gonna change the value data on the first one to one. And the second one, as I mentioned above, probably at this time 21H2. As you can see, once you do that, it actually it shows one here but it doesn't show 21H2 here. It shows a number, but that's okay. And then you can close the registry editor and reboot. So again, this is in beta, but if it's something you want to try, I will n just recreate this video if anything changes before and when Windows 11 comes out. But for the most part, group policy editor is the way to go. And again, follow the enable group policy editor. It's really easy to do. There's a tutorial here for it as well. To walk you through it step by step it's really as simple as running a batch file and you're done i've done it on multiple computers never had a problem so this will give you an idea going forward what you're gonna have to go through to block windows 11 and again check back with major geeks when you find out windows 11 is released and look for one of those programs like stop win 10 that will update and hopefully block windows 11 if that's what you want to do all early we'll see what happens when it comes out thanks for watching as always everybody see you